Hi guys, Paul Pluter on the Paul Pluter channel. Today I'm doing some paid reviews uh, because I don't do shit for free. And uh, we've got this great query in. What does Archie think of the Casio Mudmaster? The Mudmaster. This is like an all-terrain watch. Some Something that a... Um, uh, you would have a guerrilla uh, warfare you'd wear there. You'd use it in uh, Iraq. It's just such a such an amazing piece here. Let's uh, before I continue, like, subscribe, and tell your mudmaster fuckhead friends about my channel. And don't forget, guys. Don't forget, man cannot live on Google Ads alone. I depend on paid reviews to keep me full time on YouTube. Uh, remember, you can sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon, you get previews to um, special bits. You get all sorts of sneaky stuff. So um, come on, guys. Work with me, not against me. Okay, this was from Michael. Archie, $25 sent to your PayPal for, uh, for a review of the Seiko Mudmaster GWG 1000 one a3 at $750. I'm not going to buy one, but I do have an older model Casio and a Citizen that has no battery to replace ever. An incredibly precise atomic technology. It's synced to a state-of-the-art atomic clock, according to Citizen. With this new Mudmaster, it looks like Casio is really improving and inquiring minds want to know what you think. Thanks a bunch. What do I think of the Casio Mudmeister? The Mudmeister? What do I think? What do I think indeed? And I gotta tell you something. If you are a macho man, macho, macho man, I got a thing for a macho man, macho, macho man. Now I gotta tell you the truth, guys. These Casio Mud Masters, man, they're just, it, it's its a shitter. It's a fucking shitter. It's a shitter. Shitter is shitter does sir. It's a fucking shitter. Okay? I'm sorry. I would like to say nice things. I would like to say, you know, yeah, use it in combat, this and that. But look, the problem is, guys, there are so many decent watches. If you're going to have a legendary life, you're going to go to Iraq. I mean, if you've got your life in, in the balance there, you may as well. If you're being shot at, you're being fired at, you're going to lose limbs, you may as well wear a bloody Rolex, don't you think? If you're going to go out, go to the pearly gates, it might be good to have a nice wristwatch on your wrist. So i got to tell you, the Mudmeister, yeah, it's plastic. It's cheap. It's nasty. It's not Swiss horology there. I mean, okay, I understand if you're going to Iraq or Afghanistan, you really don't want to wear a Patek Philippe. Sure, I understand. I understand. But let's be honest there. The beautiful thing about a Rolex is <laughs> it's so versatile. Look at this. Explorer 2. Uh, it's, it's a real watch. It's a man's watch. This is a watch that would piss off any wife. Any wife. You said, hey, honey, I want to buy a new Rolex or I want to buy a pre-owned, pre-owned. Uh, what do you think? How much is it, honey? Ah, oh, it's about 7,000 Aussie. What? You want to spend that much? You know it's worth doing because the bitches won't let you get it. So I got to tell you the truth, guys. Come on, work with me, not against me. These mud masters, it's just a garbage watch. It's garbage. It's for... You know, it's just garbage. It's not a real watch. It's garbage. It's plastic. It's, it's, yes, quartz is so, I understand it is reliable. It's, yeah, 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 it is. It, it, it probably is a great watch. But if you're going to do that, you're going to leave a legacy. Why don't you wear a fucking Rolex? Why don't you wear a Rolex? Wear a Rolex. And you know what? You want to be really fancy pantsy? Put it on a moose. Strap Company NATO. That would be really high end cool. That's what I'd be doing. Man, you gotta understand, these fucking shitters are garbage. They're garbage. They're absolute garbage. I mean, who's gonna wear a Casio Mudmeister? I mean, fuck. Fuck. What, what, what do you.
you want to wear that for? If you're putting your life, your life is on the line, push it to the line with red line. You want to wear Rolex, man. You want to wear Rolex. You want to wear Rolex. You want to, you want to know if you were killed in combat, some bastard's going to hack your arm off. Hack your arm off to take it. Now, you know, it's very interesting in that Malaysian Airlines that went, that got uh, exploded over Ukraine. The corpses, they were looking for watches. They're not going to, they're not going to bother if it's got a fucking mudmaster attached to it. They want the Rolex. They want the Rolex. They wanted the Rolexes. They wanted Rolex. 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 That's what they want. They wanted the Rolex, man. Look at the fat boy over there. He's got a Rolex on. That's what they wanted, man. I mean, these mudmeisters. Oh, shit. What are you going to do with these mudmeisters? I mean, these are disposable watches. These are, uh, you wear them for five, ten years. When they stop working, when it gets a bit cruddy, you throw it out and buy a new one. I mean, it's just shit. Disposable life. Everything in our life these days is disposable and it's instant, instant this, instant mashed potatoes, instant this, instant that, instant gratification, instant this, instant that. Fuck me dead. Man up. Man up and get a Rolex. Get a Rolex. Rolex. Get a Rolex, man. No battery needed either. It's called automatic. Perpetual. It's an oyster perpetual. I mean, this is a legend, man. That's what you pass down to your grandkids, not some fucking mudmeister. What the fuck are you going to do with a mudmeister? I mean, it's not worth overhauling or service, is it? It's a throwaway fucking item. It's like a washing machine or a microwave. It's not like an agar oven, is it? You know? Aga, A-G-A. You know, that's what it is. You want, you know, I don't know what to say. I mean, people these days, they're so fickle. I want this. I want that. You want a mudmeister. Well, fuck me dead. Don't. Don't do it. Don't do it. you got to get a Rolex. Get a Rolex, man. Get a sub or an Explorer or a GMT, man. That's what I'd be doing. When you come back, it's legendary, man. I've been out in the field. I've been out to Nam. I've been out in Nam. Nam, fuckers. I wore the Rolex. That's what you want. I've been to Nam. Actually, what did I wear in Nam? Fuck. Good question. I think I wore my X2. I think I wore the Explorer 2. You know, that's the kind of shit you want to wear. You don't want to wear a fucking mudmaster plastic piece of fucking shit. Fucking just that's just for low, cheap, nasty shitters. That's what it is. It's a nasty shitter. You want to have something. You want to have a bit of personality. I mean, as a man, what piece of jewelry? What can we wear? What can we do? Nothing. Nothing we can fucking do. These feminist Nazi Nazi nasty bitches have taken everything away. We can't have briefcases. We can't have this. Can't have that. No, 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 no. Well, I want a fucking Rolex. I want a fucking Explorer 2. And I want to fucking drive my tank through your backfield. That's what I want to do. I want to drive a tank through your lawn. Lawn care, fuckers. Lawn care. That's what I want to do. I want to fucking, you know, I'm just telling you, man. You want to fucking, you want to wear a good watch that gives you presents. I mean, when you get arrested, what are they going to do with a fucking mud master, meister? You know, you can at least bargain your way out of trouble, can't you? Hey, I'll take that, and I'll take that, that, you know. That's what you do. You negotiate, man. It's the first rule of combat. Dazzle your enemy with bullshit, with consumer bullshit. That's what you got to do, man. I'm just saying, this is what you got to fucking do. This is what you got to do, man. Get with the program. Get with the program. That's what you need to fucking do. Get with the program, and uh, this is it, man. It's all... This is a mudmeister. What the fuck are you going to do with a mudmeister? I mean, fuck me, dude. It's cheap. It's nasty. It's vicious. It's vile. This is vile stuff. If you haven't got enough money, buy yourself a tutor. A tutor. Buy a tutor. But, man, come on. Get something decent. They're not going to hack your arm off if you've got a mudmeister on it, are they? Man, this is just what you got to do, man. Be an individual. Wear a fucking Rolex. Wear a Rolex, man. <clears throat> I, I don't know what to say, man. You just got to... Sometimes in life, you got to take a stand and you got to wear Rolex. Rolex. I 
I'm Paul Pluto. This is the Paul Pluto Channel. Tell me what you guys think of that. Okay.